everyone's got their different opinions though, eh? That's the problem. Yep. Did your map show this track? Yeah, on my phone it does. Go on to the beach? Yeah, it does, yeah. Not on my map, but on my phone map it does. So, the beach isn't any good. Sort of sand driving, not mud driving. I oh, know, what's going on? Yeah, we've got a few coming up behind us now. Control back on for this road. <laughs> Jeez, as bumpy as muddy as anything. Good fun though. We're having a ball. Doesn't get better, does it? But anyway, we uh, just not sure what we're going to do today. Um, yeah. Get in there and do it. <laughs> hey, you know, I've, I've got an idea. Let's see that. I'll just pinch Mark's one. What do you got under here, mate? See that? Attaches and that's got your sump guard as well. Yeah, right. And it that's just, what I need. It fits perfectly. Like, Kayon do such an amazing job with their bash blades. Yeah. 
they'll powder coat it for you like they've done with mine. Just yep. gives you that peace of mind, eh? Yeah. Perfect setup. Whoa! Oi. That's the time, mate. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. I've just spotted something. I've just spotted something. <laughs> Have a look at this. You get out of that. You get out of Channel it. Kenilworth chocolate mousse. <laughs> I'll be uh, there, having mate. a look at that later. Mm. Oh, you get your Herbert Evans pies. You get everything in there. We've brewed coffee too, mate. Love it. Love it. What a setup. That's what I need. You come home, but Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, they're laughing. Said that I got a some of the hit back under the. Um, at least, at least you know where it is. Oh, it's been long. Oh, zip ties, eh? Yep. Oh, zip tied up. Zip, zip ties. Oh, I got a bit of thousand mile an hour tape. There we go. That's what we'll do. Zip tie and a bit of that, she'll never come off. That's it. Just need a adjustable spanner. bolts in here, it's come right out of it. Unless, um, unless, you know, what, what have we done? I reckon it's been, um, maybe it's been just loose when I came out of it. Yeah, it could be. No, it might be something else. Was that too big as well? Yeah, it wouldn't be. Surely it wouldn't be as well. That's a. You've done a good job. <laughs> that light is amazing. That top bit up first. Here? No. Right at the end that's hitting the ground? Yeah, I tried that. Oh, you can't fold that up? No. No. That's right. If you've got a. Alright, I need a, a 12. Here we go. Now I've got an exposed yeah, front diff. Oh, mate, we're getting there, I think. <laughs> it's, I'll, get, I need a new tool I'll get an angle from the other side. Let's have a look. Oh, Just I need that there. screwdriver, mate. You what? I need that screwdriver. Do you need me around there? There we go. Oh, there we go. There we go, he's got it. Oh, got we're getting it. dribbled on. So you catch rainwater. See, that should be enough to get you access there now. I reckon while I'm doing it, I should be able to get in there, eh? Yep. I just can't get my arm around. <laughs> I'm all crossed up here. Oh! Oh, I just lost a bit of mud in my face. <laughs> oh! Where's my screw hole? No, oh, it's not not working, mate. Still not enough. What? Oh. It's like from here to here. It has really folded that up, hasn't it? Yeah. It needs to be bent further. That's what I mean, down like that, yeah. Oh, I just got myself again. You just can't get a purchase on it to bend it down, can you? No. Nah. <clears throat> That's it. So we having a win? Well, I think. Can you pass me a the other spot socket thing? Which? Let me go. The one you gave me. The um, oh, my one. The other one, yeah. So now that we're out, you should be able to. Okay. There you go, my friend. Look at that down that little hole there. Look at him. Look at him getting in. Oh, got, I'm having a win. I'm having a win. She's coming. She's going to be a few uh, a few days, but she's coming. No, no, the bolt's coming, mate. I'll coming? Go. Yeah, she's coming. coming. Gee, that was a mission. Oh, Something that out. we would have thought was so simple. I know, it's not like a major thing, but it's a major thing.
Yeah, it is. It's got that little thing, that hook in oh, the middle. That, that middle bit. Yeah. Of course it has. Yeah. Not, not anymore. Not anymore. It's not hooked yeah, on. Yeah. All right, let's see what damage there is. Let's go around and let's have a look at this. Oh, here it comes. Got the baby. Oh. Uh, hey, folks. How are you? This is uh, roadside mechanics at its best. Right. Whoa. Look at that. <laughs> Look at, Look at that. the bash. You've done a good job. Oh, yeah. You folded it right in half. It obviously hit something. It must have been loose at the front. I reckon it's loose. That's just... yeah. I don't even have any room to take it home. Oh. I, don't, I don't think the ground sheet did too much. My well, friend. Look at the water dripping. It's dripping. Yeah. It's like a Where's the showers? Oh, there's a lake we can jump in. Is that a new product that you're using? Yeah, I like it. It's a sandy product. <laughs> so what's that? I'll be careful. I don't have a dish, uh, dip, yeah. front dip uh, bash plate. <laughs> Mark, we've just pulled up, mate. What's this lake called? <laughs> lake Birabeen. Birabeen, there Birabeen. we go. So this is just an out no, of the way lake. Lake Birabeen's that way. <laughs> what are we, Boobagin? Boobagin. Lake Boobagin. Boobagin, we yeah, know, we know what we're talking about, don't Never we? Never been here. No, awesome, mate. It's my first time here too, so. Yeah, okay. And look, we just put the bushwhacker awning up. Look at this, just showing Mark the awning. Look at that. How He's loving it. awesome was that? How quick? Yep, oh, Instantly very quick. Instantly form, out of the weather, yep. happy days. And we're going to have a coffee in a minute, aren't we, mate? Oh. And how are we going to boil the kettle, no, mate? Wait. We're no, showing Mark the new no idea. iTech World 2000, PS2000. Oh. Battery station, mate. Perfect. Just plug the kettle in and boil up some water. What do you reckon? Let's get into it. This guy's a Euro coffee. Uh, Love a coffee. Yeah. Love a coffee. Yeah. Mark, what do you think of my setup, mate? You like it? He's, Love it. He's made himself a home. It's easy. Perfect. I asked him if you need any lighting, but he, he no. said he was fine. So We're fine. Yeah. I'll go and boil this kettle, mate. Get some chicken wraps into us. Oh, mate. Sounds good. And peanuts. Salt and vinegar oh, peanuts. Salt and vinegar. Yeah, salt and vinegar. So I've just got this uh, collapsible 20 litre um, water. They do actually have water here, it says. There's a sign that says they've got water. Yeah, there's a tap over there. So um, if you want to conserve your water, go and get the, get the water out of the tap. So I've got this um, collapsible kettle. So I'm going to use that to boil the water. And I've just found a tap. So. This just comes up like so, like that, and now I'll go and get some water from over here. There's a sign there that says um, water, so uh, you know, I suppose that's right. We're boiling the water, so it should be off. Let's go to get in here. Oh, here we go. Just open this. Oh, look at this. Look at this area. This is like off the beaten track, I think, where no one really knows about. So here we go, Lake Boomagen. Yeah, look at that. Plenty of walks. Look at that lake. I don't know if you can see it through there, but it looks massive. You know, I better keep my uh, keep doing what I'm supposed to be doing. Uh, treat before use, oh. and it doesn't have a tap on it. <laughs> How bad's that? No, how's that? No, you wouldn't want to be hanging out for some water. Maybe this one's got a, a thing on it. Let's see what this has got. Maybe. Oh, yeah. Water in that. Let's see what happens. Oh, yeah. Nah. I like the colour of that one. I'll go back, I think I'll go back to my um, my water in the car, thanks, I think, for that. Mate, um... Did you top of that car here? Did you top of that car here? It doesn't have any bloody dirt on it. Oh, yeah, we just got here, so... <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry, it's off, bro. Oh, well, can you tell us where you washed it off? <laughs> <laughs> oh, nice. Oh, there's a leaf on there. 
Whoa! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh I don't even you got your car dirty, Mark. Look at it. <laughs> oh, mate, you barbecue oh. chicken cheese wrap. Look at that. Hey. Oh, perfect. Let me just go put this kettle on, mate. Right. We got coffee in a minute. There you go. She's all ready to go. You just got to plug her in. So I'll just put up there for a minute. Turn her on. Then I've got to turn this on. She's on. Move my camera out of the way. And uh, plug her in, mate. Yeah, you hold the camera. I'll show you how it works. So, um, she's on, see? 100%. Plug her in. So you've got three, um, three powers there. And uh, turn her on. Right on. Turn her on here. Boom, she's away. Go on, we'll, have, that. we'll have some uh, hot water in a minute. <laughs> yeah. Pumping away. Yeah, beauty. Really? Beautiful, isn't it? Yeah. That's fantastic. It is. I'll have coffee in a minute. <laughs> Where to come and get my lunch? Mark, how was our coffee, mate? Absolutely beautiful. Yeah? That's from Brewed Coffee in Tormouth. Not bad, is it? For and, um, a, out in the bush? bush? Yeah, yeah. On, with the AeroPress. Now, yeah, mate, as you know, We've got that iTech World battery box to, you know, we're going to test her out and yep. run it and all that kind of stuff. No, it's going to impress you, of course. Of course. <laughs> well, I just hope it keeps my fridge cold. That's it, That'll mate. That'll be the test. Yep, yep. And pull our water. Yes. So, iTech World have given me uh, some presents for you, mate. And I'm going to hand these over to you. For me? For you. All for you. So, we've got an iTech World. All right. Stubby cooler. How's that, mate? You beauty! And uh, if you need to open a bottle or two, it's not a bottle opener. That's for you, I take well. And uh, mate, if you're short on hats, I got a hat for you. Fantastic, mate. Well, look at that. Or sealed up even. Look at that, I take well. There we go. You beauty, so mate. So that came with the uh, 200 watt solar blanket. That I will say that they have sent out to me. Um, to try out, give it a shot. Well, so here we are on Fraser Island, and we're going to definitely give it a run. We'll give it an absolute, and even with the overcast conditions, so that'll yeah. that'll give that solar panel a good test. That's right. So we'll see how we go throwing put the yep. charge back into it. That's it. Back into the battery station. New so, beauty. Yeah. Look at this. Okay. So you never heard of this lake, mate, uh, Mark? No. No. Never. Very um, dirty water, isn't it? Yeah. From all, the, all those trees, right? There's a little track that went around there where we should go for a wander and see where that leads. Yeah, you to. can't really. I suppose. Um, Looks like it's a lot clearer over the other side, doesn't it? Yeah. I suppose lakes aren't tidal, are they? Really? Oh, no. no. So this is, yeah. Not really inviting here, this section of the lake, anyway. We better go find a camp spot, Mark. Yeah. So, what do you reckon, mate? Camp They're almost set up time, isn't it, mate? Just a bit out. Crack open a, a bourbon, and you're gonna you like a bit of rum, don't you, mate? Oh, ho, ho, ho. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I reckon he likes the rum after that reaction. I tell you, look at him go. He's running. <laughs> nice. There you go. That was like. Uh, What's it called again? Boogigan. Boogigan. There was another lake here too, wasn't there? Yeah.
So I'm just using this Explore Oz map um, so you can see that's where we are. We're heading to Lake Birabeen. So it's just a single lane track basically. Uh, Mark's just radioed ahead to say there's a couple of cars coming so I just thought I'd uh, pull off while uh, just pull off while, um, while I had a chance to so I'm just waiting for them to come past. Oh, how nice is this? Oh. Look at that colour, mate. Oh, wow, look at this oh. thing. Beautiful. Gee, that looks all right, doesn't it? Yeah. Shame the sun's not out. I <laughs> know, oh, look at that white sand. It's like we're on the beach, mate. Wow. Awesome. And look at that again, we're the only ones here. Hey. <laughs> Brother 150 out of here. Looks awesome. That is nice. Maybe the weather's a bit on the yeah. cool side, mate. What a shame. Gee whiz. Well, there you go. I've never heard of this lake. No, I have never been here. Yeah, wow. It's beautiful. It's similar to like the Kent. It's got the water, it's a little bit of colour, but it's same silica sand. Yeah. Clear, beautiful and clear. Have a look at it. Wow. Oh, yeah. Look at that, eh? It's like being on the beach, mate. What's it taste like? Is it fresh? Oh. Ah, would you check this out, eh? Woo! Oh, I tell ya. Mark says it's fresh water. You have a taste of it, eh? Oh, wow. Fresh water at the beach, mate. So the only other foot. <laughs> someone else here. Well, there is. <laughs> the land. Your, oh yeah, we'll have because from looking that we have to go right up here somewhere yeah, onto right. the eastern beach. Yeah, yeah. But we'll have a look at the map. I'm yeah. pretty sure that's where we got to go. Yeah. Checking out these look at these beasts, mate. Oh, aren't they beautiful? Hey, hey, look at them. Prados, Prado 150s. So, is this Birabeen, isn't it? Yep, I think that's what we said it was. So we're at Lake Birbeen. So we're there. So... I can't see that from the reflection. Camp right. zone 2, see? So we yep. are here. So we'll go up. And there'll be a right turn. Take us onto the... To the zone. Zone. What's no that worries, orange mate. track? What's that orange track mean? They're all different colours. Central Lakes Scenic Drive. Oh, okay. So that's a Central Lake Scenic Drive. So we can go through there and then we go right and come. Oh, that takes us through past Lake Wobby. Well, we won't. we'll do that tomorrow. Lake Wobby, Lake yep. Mackenzie. So, so next road, we'll take a right and that'll yep. take us onto the Eastern Beach again and then okay. we'll try and find ourselves a good like sheltered campsite. Spot, yeah, so guys, what I've noticed on Fraser Island, there's so many little tracks and inland tracks and different things. You could spend a month here, literally. So this little part we're going down, they've put something in the road, I'd say on the road to help, probably more so people coming back up the other way, uh, on the sand like boards or something in the, in the sand. So we're just cruising down and the scenery just keeps changing like this forest, I'll show you, look. So um, I will say I've been a bit more cautious uh, on this trip because I, yeah, obviously because I broke that knuckle on my 
passenger side before. So um, any tree roots or step ups, I'm probably a bit more over cautious for good reason, I suppose. So we're just on our way to let's see if we've got any signal. I just sent those pictures. I was just about. Oh, we got signal here, mate. Full signal, not just any signal. <laughs> Are we going to have it where we're going, or shall I send a few from here? Hang on, the missus is ringing. Yeah, right. You take it. I'll send a few photos myself. We're just at uh, you're wrong. So um, we just pulled in here for a toilet stop and now we're heading to zone two um, to find ourselves a camp spot. Hey Mike. Hey. I need that battery box mate if that's okay. Just battery to... Battery box? What do you want a battery box for mate? Just to run the <laughs> fridge mate. Oh the iTech World PS2000. Oh yeah. Oh mate, hold on, I'll grab it for you mate. Hello. Right it's here somewhere. Do you need a hand to lift it or you're good? Oh I should be all good. I hear they're pretty light. No, not today. It's been terrible, hasn't it? But I'd rather be here than at work. Tell you what. Here we go, mate. I made a little slot there. Will it fit in there? Oh, look at that. Like a glove. Does that suit you, mate? Beautiful. Look at that. Just turn her on. Press the button. Light her up. 96%. You remembered to charge it? Yep, you beauty. 96%, All right. mate, because uh, we bought the kettle, remember? We did. Yeah. Where do you... Uh... So you plug her in just in... Somewhere there. In there, yeah. The one, yep, that's the oh, yeah, you want the cigarette? Plug her in, mate. Long enough, yep. Yeah. There you go. Should be... All right, let's have a look. I should, oh, I've got to turn her on. There's a little button down here, mate. Oh, sorry, mate. Do it. Yep, you got to turn that on. See the little orange light? Oh, yep, so that's going. And, uh, she well, let's have a look. See if this fridge, look at that. She's working, she's running. Oh, mate, laughing. You beauty. Be sweet for tonight. Champion, thank you, my oh, friend. Oh, no worries, mate. Legend. Woo! <laughs> thank you, Autech World. Here we go. Look you'll, at be, you'll be laughing, mate. If you be want to interesting charge to see. It, if you want to charge anything else, just, you just got to hit that button there. Yep. And that turns on you. There's a quick charge. Yep. And just your normal charge, USB. All right. And um, if you want to boil your kettle, it's just on the side. I'll better get some dinner out of the fridge then, hey? All right. Sounds good. I'll better get me walls up, mate. And we'll see how much power that uses yeah, for the well, night. Yeah, at the moment anyway. <laughs> Is it the table or is it the the heat was going down and oh, you'll no. see this is all warped. Oh, is that you? <laughs> okay, so squeezing here, mate. going on here mate? Mate. What are you up to? Oh just a bit of beef curry just uh oh, beef curry? I've spent a lot of time and love on this beef curry so you better Far appreciate out. it. Oh mate that is one good looking beef curry mate. What's in it? Tell me what's in it. Mate it's a little home recipe we've got a bit of cabbage, bit of capsicum, a bit of fresh rump, ginger, all the herbs and spices mate. Oh mate. Far out eh? Now you're cooking under my awning here. 
How good is this? You like it? Believe it or not, it is <laughs> blowing an absolute gale out there. Yep. Have a look at this. Not a breath of wind. I've had to take my jumper off. Yeah, actually, I'm, I'm thinking the same thing. It's getting hot under here. It's like being in a big cabin, mate. Look at oh, that. it's beautiful, isn't it? So, um, thanks to Bullies Off-Road for the uh, Bushwhacker awning and the uh, walls. Easy to set up, wasn't it? Quick. Yeah, yeah. It was pretty quick, actually. Yeah, just all, um, all the Velcro there. So we are, at, we are like, covered in, aren't we? Look at this. Oh, it's beautiful. Got my swag there. I didn't need to bring that electric blanket, did I? No, you didn't. <laughs> nice. So, folks, well, I just thought I'd go through a bit of a setup here, what we've got going tonight. There's uh, many different setups, obviously, that people have. And um, it's good to have someone else along as well because, you know, they have a different setup um, to what you might have or I might have or whatever. So, um, Mark's here and he's got the, the uh, one of those little gas cooker things, so the Camp Master. It's a double burner and it takes those little little canisters there. So, um, you know, like I'm sitting, standing here comparing it because I haven't got mine out. I've got the double, you know, like the double um, uh, hyper flame and uh, from 10, you know, 10 wheel Toowoomba with a, you know, four and a half kilo gas bottle, which I haven't got out yet. But, um, you know, Mark's just got this one out. And it's pumping away nicely, isn't it? Cooking your curry, mate. Oh, beautiful. Isn't it? Yeah, beautiful. Yep, everything that's warm, just waiting on the rice. Now, um, the other thing too, mate, you got a Prado and you haven't got drawers or anything in the back of yours or, no, or um, you know, any 12 volt system or, at all. But you're now using the battery, battery station. Yep. And uh, you don't need anything. You just, that's right, just running your fridge at the moment, isn't it, mate? I don't. There is a method to my madness. Yeah. So the reason I haven't got that set up yet is because I'm looking to upgrade to the new Prado when it comes out next year. So I don't want to spend that money. Looking just yet. at your setup, that's obviously something that I want to get once my once I get my new Prado. But at the moment, because I'm sort of that in between stage, waiting to get the new one, I'll uh, just function and still out here with you, having an awesome oh, time. And mate, yeah, you know it's fantastic. Well, I was just telling the folks at home that. Um, it's good going camping with you know other people and that because everyone's got a different type of way of doing it. Yep. And um, you know, like yours is pretty simple here with this double burner. You pulled it out, no worries at all. You know, no big gas bottle or anything like you know. Like if you compare that to me, that's what I've got. Easy done. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. So um, no, that's good, mate. Look at me, eh? I'm as cozy as can be. Look at this. I got the three walls up this time. So uh, and I've got the swag sitting here, Darshi swag. Mark's got the cooking going here. This is absolutely awesome. It's blowing a gale out on the other side of these walls. So folks, I'm gonna leave that there. We're gonna get stuck into a few more uh, bourbons and uh, into this really nice curry that Mark's got going. So um, stay tuned and uh, there's more to come on this exciting Fraser Island adventure. Gary, here we come. Woo